uh, Texas Tech, a team that I like personally. Texas we Tech, like by, Texas Tech. we do like Texas Tech. Um, they they return a ton of starters from last year. Uh, I looked across their depth chart, um, and, and I'll, I'll have to do the specific counts once uh, you talk about Texas Tech. They've pretty much got seniors or transfers at every single position. They've got every, a lot of grad transfers, uh, which means a lot of strength, a lot of knowledge. Um, talk to. Uh, Texas Tech quarterback Tyler Shuck on the radio show I work for too and I asked him I was like you know how because most people that we see when things don't go right they either transfer or they, they think they're ready for the NFL and they leave early well for Tyler Shuck he left Oregon and goes to Texas Tech and he doesn't even start for his first couple of years he battles with Donovan Smith um and he basically talked about how he feels like he's ready, more ready now than what he would be if he would have left after three years um, at the quarterback position, just learning the playbook, learning the scheme. Um, he, he said his offense is more like kind of the uh, like the NFL type offense. Uh, the QB coach is with Pat Mahomes' coach, so for me, he's tall. He can throw the pat. He can throw the ball. Um, he's he's uh, he's a good pocket passer. Obviously, he's a little skinny. Health wise, will be the one thing for him. But I mean, they return their top running back. Turn their top wide receiver. I think this Texas Tech team is a pretty dangerous team that people should start looking out for. Yeah, you know, I think this is probably the best team that Texas Tech has had since that kind of that year when Texas Tech, Oklahoma, and Texas all had one loss in the Big 12. I think that was 2008. Hmm. Yeah, I think 2008, 2009. Um, but that being said, you know, I think that, like you said, seniors all throughout their depth chart. Um, a returning quarterback for the first time in a while where it's like his team and not having to worry about another guy on, on the roster kind of going back and forth with him. Um, and, 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 and it is, it needs to be said, like having a senior quarterback and like a sixth year senior quarterback, like a Tyler mm -hmm. show who has seen a lot of places. He's seen a lot of things. He's experienced a lot of things at this college level. Um, and he's prepared for just about anything. So I think that, um, Texas Tech is really lined up to have a great season, and it'll, I will be very shocked if they don't win at least eight or nine games and maybe contend for that Big 12 championship game. Yeah, they're one of those teams that we mentioned before that won a bowl game. They had a hot start um, at the end of the season. Good finish, sorry, hot finish. But looking at their depth chart just now, they've got 18 of 22. 18 of 22 players that are seniors, grad grad seniors, or redshirt covid Gray shirt, red shirt, vaccinated seniors or whatever. <laughs> so, I mean, and then the other four are juniors too. So lastly, we're going to talk about the